Y'all yeah, got a family feed, so let's get into this tea. We are about to get into Tea Room's video with her exaggerated title. <laughs> I'm here for it, though. Uh, badass flow got FOE touched <laughs> at the club. Jordan hospitalized. Corey calls ice on Carmen. What? Really upset after Carmen's recent video. Now on Carmen's video, she did state that she doesn't think Corey deserves to see the kids yet after he put them out. Carmen stated that Corey put their things out and she stated that she didn't have anywhere to go with her kids and he told her to figure it out. So now after mm. Carmen's video, Corey went onto Instagram and he posted, if I don't deserve to see my kids, you don't deserve to be on US soil. Then he- Damn. He goes on to tweet trash and Not my like I ain't got access to ice. Don't this fool know? That you will go to jail? You are the one who illegally <laughs> married a woman who obviously was an immigrant. And you knew that. You knew that y'all was going into an illegal marriage. Unless you was really in love at first. Because you were. This nigga trying to get locked up. Are you serious? Wow. <laughs> Somebody tell him. Somebody please tell Corey that it is absolutely illegal to be an immigrant in the United States. But however, it is even more illegal to marry someone illegally who ain't legally supposed to be. Somebody get him. Somebody get him. Okay. Cause I just. Ice and girl. Like I ain't got access to ice. Oh now, my If you God. guys don't know what ice is, it's the U.S. immigration and customs. So things are beginning to get very messy here. Not sure how all this is going to play out. Carmen, he can't do shit. First of all, you're legal. That's number one. Number two, he illegally married you and is publicly admitting it. You already did your job, sis. No cap. You already legal. Don't be trying to let him think he can unlegal you. Unless you do some wild shit or, well, no, you're fine. And you have children here. She has American children. Mind you, if they send Carmen back to wherever the hell she came from or whatever, and I'm saying that because that's how he's saying it, don't he know that she's taking her children So, Corey think that America is just going to let them illegal children stay here? Okay. But I will keep you guys updated. But let's move on to this next topic with Neek and Dwayne. Now, supporters are speculating that Neek and Dwayne may have broken up. A comment on Neek's recent video reads, am I tripping or did Neek and Dwayne really break up? No longer following each other, pictures down on Instagram, bed only has hers pillow. And then at the end around the 22 minute mark, she said, I'ma tell myself that since I'm all alone. When saying she's gonna write that she is beautiful and amazing, I was rooting for them to make it. So now this is the statement that Neek made in her vlog, stating that she is all alone. Beautiful, honey, you're amazing. I'm gonna tell myself that since I'm fucking all alone. <laughs> and look at it. Girl, they'll be back Focus. together next week. Cutie and this little man. And I did check, and they are no longer following each other. And they will be right back together next week. And Neek is no longer following Zion either, but Dwayne and Zion have been out partying he was out with him last night maybe oh, that has something no. to do with why neek and Dwayne are no longer together Zion don't y'all hate when people hook up when you ain't cool with them no more that's crazy it seems to keep a lot of women and partying around him but hopefully they do get back together we do know they break up and get back together a lot but let's move on to this next topic with crystal karina and PJ. Now, for some reason, they have unfollowed PJ. I know exactly why they unfollowed PJ. Girl, PJ was at that party when Flo was, uh, uh, well, when Karina was attempting to fight, um, 
Noonie and Flo was saying he'll slap everybody, beat up everybody, whatever the case may be. And he was over there in the corner at a distance. <laughs> they are no I longer know exactly cool with him. Why that I happened. mean, they were out partying with him like every night. PJ was there when Karina actually punched Nooney. So not sure what happened there, but I will keep you guys updated. But let's move on to this next topic with Jazz and Tay. And Crystal actually throwing a little shade in a recent TikTok that she posted. Ooh, like... I was saying, like, nigga, you look better with that clown ass. Sometimes you gotta let a nigga know, right? You look better with that. You look better with. You know what? That was mean of me to call it. Because the Nick D be more of a clown than the. Um, like. I was saying. So people began to call her miserable, bitter, and messy. And Crystal was actually liking some of those comments. But let's move on to this next topic with this situation that went down last night with Jazz, Jordan, and Flo. <laughs> now, this is all alleged because I don't have any concrete evidence, but I will say something went on last night. Jazz posted, Don't call me, don't text me, don't ask me ish about tonight. If you F with that, I don't F with you simple now then sierra jordan's baby mama went off on some random girl hold on, hold on. so jazz is the one who who said something first don't call me don't text me don't ask me shit about tonight if you f with that i don't if you f with that i don't f with you simple okay and then and who is this whole friends i want the friends the mama the aunt whoever where you at where you I guess where you hoes at, y'all watching me for show, say something. Child, she wasn't talking about Flo. She was talking about the girl who hit um, Jordan in, that fa in his face. Once yo itches out of jail, come see me, ho. Lame A-B, I'm on your ass, uh, you bad built funky. <laughs> oh, bad built funky itch. 777 in the chat. Turn states, once your BA get out of jail, come see me. Lame a B word, I'm on your A, you bad built effing B. Now, then and she also the says, did it. who this <clears throat> old friends? I want the friends, the mama, the aunt, whoever, where you owes. Well, Sierra wasn't wrong for uh, talking to them girls. I thought that Sierra said something about Flo. She was minding her business on that. At y'all watching me for show, say something, pop yo ish please then she goes on to twitter and states this n-word flow is a b a big b a scary b lame a b p a a b n-word okay so i had to block a lot out because she was going off on flow now here's the oh, tea allegedly so ended up saying now people flow. are stating that flow allegedly pulled up to the club last night and got some girls to bust a bottle on jordan's head causing Jordan to go to the hospital. Now, again, I can't confirm this because this is all alleged. But By the way, if they watched um, Tea Room video, they know that she say every time I can't confirm or it may not be true. Now, she has done it a couple of times where she said it was true, but I ain't gonna lie, it did turn out being true. Um, but certain, certain situations, she has been dead ass wrong. But in some situations, she has been right. This is what is being said. Now, we'll keep you guys updated. If I hear any more on this, I'm pretty sure we'll hear more about it. But I will keep you guys updated as always. Let me know your opinion on everything down in the comment section below. Yeah, them boys out there iced out. Rich, just letting everybody know where they at. <laughs> Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I am done with this video. Um, do y'all think Sierra was wrong for saying something? Um, especially when it comes to flow. That's that's man shit. She should have stayed out of it. Uh, but I completely understand why she would have wanted to protect, you know, Jordan. So y'all let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Uh, I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.